So what bred her? A king pumpkin. Oh. We need to operate as quickly as possible um, to get that puppy out, hopefully alive, um, and to save Lucy's life. All right, here we go. I feel the puppy. Um, it's just I need to make a bigger incision to get him out easily. He's a huge. Almost there. The head is just right at the edge. Right, here we go. It's a big baby. Yeah, it's really big. And so this is our puppy. Hector, do you want to shake him off a little, please? Keep him warm. As you can see, he's breathing, moving his tongue, moving his lips. I think Lucy would not have been able to pass that puppy if we had just left her. That puppy probably would have died, um, and then she would have potentially died with it. Um, so, you know, which is just another reason why we should be doing spay neuter. You know, this was an unplanned pregnancy and potentially life threatening. So, we're going to get her fixed. The owner's really happy to do that um, and prevent this kind of stress for her as well as for Lucy uh, in the future. This is a pretty cool part of the job, you know. This is the oxygen cage and it's heated also. So, we want the baby and the mom to stay nice and warm right now. So, the puppy's already trying to follow the heat. And probably looking for mom. Mom's that way, buddy. Hey, buddy. Let's show mama. All right, hey. All right. Yeah, so everything's gone well. Um, the puppy is alive and a boy. A boy? Yeah, so oh my God. it'll still be another couple hours before they're ready to go home. <laughs> Thank you so much. We saved our puppy. Yeah. Good. We're glad to do it. So, um, both mom and puppy are doing well. Thank you so much. No problem. Take care, okay? <laughs> oh, I am just overwhelmingly happy. I was so worried that she wouldn't make it. The puppy wouldn't make it. Wow. This is the best news we could have had. <laughs> <laughs>